Hallelujah. More things are rocked by prayer than this world has ever known. Our choir will come and give us our prayer selection, followed by our congregational prayer, which will be led by Lady Tiffany Keith, First Lady of Tree of Life in Jeffersonville, Indiana, in that order, in Jesus' name. Touch the 
Sometimes we make the mistake of putting this, but not that. Glory to God. But it only works when we put it on. Amen. And I put it on. Praise God. I magnify, I bless the Lord because He has been so very good. Praise God. Oh, have you greeted your neighbor? Have you told them how much you appreciate them being here? Bless God. Amen. Give them a smile. Yeah. Praise God. I bless God. Might get a little rocky, and it's nice to have a neighbor that you've already greeted. And I want to take you to uh, the book of First Samuel, First Samuel, the seventeenth chapter, and uh, want to talk. A little bit more about David and Goliath. Man, praise God. I talked some last week just on David's mindset. Praise God. But there's more to a battle than a good conversation. Well, Praise God. We need to be at a place where if we're going to fight, we're going to win. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Praise God. 1 Samuel 17, uh, starting at verse number 8. Strange place to start, but pray for me. And he stood and cried unto the armies of Israel and said unto them, Why are ye come out to set your battle in array? Am not I a Philistine? Ye servants of uh, to Saul, Choose you a man for you. Let him come down to me. If he be able to fight with me and to kill me, then will we be your servants. But if I prevail against him, kill him. Then shall ye be our servants and serve us. And the Philistine said, I defy the armies of Israel this day. Give me a man that we may fight together. And when Saul and all Israel heard those words, of the Philistine they were dismayed and greatly afraid ah uh, battles are hard and it is really best 
not to get in them. Especially when you're not sure if you can win. Praise God. It's always better. <laughs> Try to talk your way out. Amen. There's nothing wrong with that. Praise God. Uh, <laughs> Especially if you value what little attraction you think you have. You want to hold on to it. Yeah. Praise God. Not the face. You can hit me in my side. <laughs> You can knock me in my back, praise God, but not the face. Right. We, 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 we generally think about, worry about, look at fighting purely as a part of just getting through battle. I want to talk to you from the subject, fight or die. All right. Praise God. Fight or die. Because whether we recognize it or not, battles are, praise God, a part of our life process. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Glory to God. Uh, the um, slogan in the African jungle, amen, is the uh, gazelle, I think it is, needs to get up early. So he can run so the lion won't catch him. The slogan for the lion, he needs to get up early so that he can catch the gazelle. Praise God. But no matter whether you are the lion or the gazelle, you need to be up Amen. and running. Amen. Glory to God. Uh, because a part of the life circle is a fight. Amen. Praise God. Um, this particular story in chapter 17 talks about this giant whose name was Goliath. And he was such an imposing fellow that just his going out into the valley every day yes, sir. Praise God, making his speech to Israel was a scary yes, yes. event. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Uh, the Bible says that he did this for 40 days. And I can't imagine somebody threatening me for 40 days. Amen. Praise God. I, I don't real I don't know the psychological effect that it will have. But I'm sure it will have an effect. Yes, yes. <laughs> Praise God. I'm either gonna sneak out <laughs> y'all ain't gonna help me. Glory to God, or I'm going to go crazy and attack. Amen. 
Praise God. Not with the size of Goliath. Not with all of the stuff he has at his disposal. Listen, when you get emotionally torn down enough, praise God, you don't know what your mindset is going to be. Amen. Uh, Goliath was described all before verse number eight to the size of a giant. Mm -hmm. Amen. And all of the things that he wore seemed like it would make him invincible. He wore a coat of mail which was metal covering his front. He wore a target covering his back. Praise God. He wore uh, shin covers to cover his legs. His spear was so big somebody else had to carry it. Shield was so big somebody else carried that. He wore a helmet, praise God, of mail. And it seemed like he had an imposing voice. Mm. Praise God. And he used it every day mm. to wear Israel down. Mm. And it was working because a man, as he did his talking, the Bible said Israel ran and hid. Mm -hmm. Praise God. And it's nothing worse than letting an enemy know Indeed. that you're scared. Indeed. Indeed. Praise God. Right. Amen. Uh, even if you are scared, mm -hmm. you ought not to act like it. Amen. Ought not to be a part of your conversation. Mm -hmm. Praise God. If you know smack, mm -hmm. you ought to talk it. Amen. <laughs> Glory to God. Uh, so often, the enemy works on us. Mm -hmm. Praise God. It's not even that he's doing it. He just makes us think. That he is big enough to do it. And it scares us. Praise God. The word that uh, kept coming up and I had to look it up because I wanted to make sure I had the proper definition. All right. Praise God. Was defied. Mm -hmm. And praise God. Goliath said to David and to Israel, mm -hmm. I defy you. Praise God. And what I recognized was that his defiance was not just at David, mm -hmm. but it was at the God yes. that David served. Yes. Praise God. How many of us have been beat down over the years, praise God, by folk defying us? Jesus, help us out. Praise Jesus, God. Recognizing that they were defying the true and the living God. Praise God. And we can't ever forget whenever the adversary is talking his talk. It's not just to you. It's to the God that you serve. And what the enemy is saying is I don't believe your God will defend you. 
and your accepting it says I agree. Say it, teach it. Praise God. So what are you telling? I'm telling us that we need to be in a conversation that we get upset mm -hmm. if our God is defied. Yes, sir. Teach it. Praise Teach God. It. Uh, the reason we have given up so much ground down through the years, mm -hmm. yes, sir. praise God, is we have not stood up for the one who stood up for us. Yes. Teach it. Teach it. Praise God. And I bless God. Yes. And when I wake up, I thank God that I woke up. Amen. And the fact that I'm in my right mind. Yeah. 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 Amen. And able to have a praise on my lips. Praise God. I need to be able to speak up for the God that I serve. Praise God. And I know I need to do a little amen uh, explaining there because we tell you, hold your peace. Yeah. The Lord's going to fight your battle. Yeah, Praise God. But you need to be able to share yeah. so that the enemy that you're about to defeat mm -hmm. knows that it was the God that you serve. Yeah. Praise Hallelujah. God. And they won't know it if you don't share. Right. Praise God. Uh, Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, praise God, with the prospect of a fiery furnace, mm -hmm. opened their mouths, mm -hmm. praise God, and said, okay, mm -hmm. live forever. But we are not careful in our conversation mm -hmm. because the God that we serve yes, yes. is able. <laughs> Glory to God. Not only is he able, mm -hmm. praise God, but he will. Yeah. Don't worry about he it. Will. Praise God. Yeah. He'll deliver us. He will. Praise God from the burning, fiery furnace. Yeah. Praise God. And he will deliver us mm -hmm. out of your hands. Yes. Praise God. Now they didn't know what God was going to do. Right. Yes, sir. Amen. Praise God. They didn't know, praise God, that the furnace being seven times hotter wasn't going to burn them immediately. Glory to God. But they still trusted God enough to talk smack. Oh, Y'all ain't going to help me. Glory to God. And in order to get to a place where you talk smack, you have to be at a place mm -hmm. where you believe. Amen. Ah, Amen. Glory to God. To come to worship every week. Mm -hmm. To come to Bible study. Yeah. Praise God every yeah. time that we have it. Mm -hmm. And you don't know that the God that you serve Amen. can do Amen. the impossible. Amen. Praise God. There's no way you can make the enemy know. Praise God that the God that you serve yes, can do the impossible. Right. Glory to God. Amen. We've got to get to a point, amen, where we recognize our lives depend mm -hmm. on trusting our God. Yes. And we're going to have to fight mm -hmm. or die. Yes, sir. Glory to God. And I know uh, we don't want to die. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Too many of us, amen, as I have shared in the past, want to go to heaven, but don't want to die. Right. And you're not going to make heaven, mm -hmm. praise God, without dying. That's right. Amen. We've got to die mm -hmm. to this world. Yeah. Right. We've got to die to the pleasures of that had us bound. Yeah, yeah. Praise God. We got to die to the things. Praise God. That keep our attention. Yeah, yeah. Glory to God. We have got to get to a place. Oh, where our nature is to fight. Yeah. 
Come on, sir. Glory to God. And, amen, fighting uh, comes in a few ways. And one of them, amen, has to be so powerful uh, that we are not throwing a natural punch. Right. Glory to God. Because, amen, the weapons of our warfare are not natural. They're not carnal. Right. But they are mighty in God. Yes. Glory to God. To the tearing down Hallelujah. of strongholds. Yes. Praise God. We Jesus. ought not to be comfortable Hallelujah. with the enemy building strongholds right. around us right. or near us. Jesus. Glory Jesus. to God. Amen. We ought to set the boundaries, amen, of the atmosphere around us. I like the example that Jesus gave me. Okay, come on. Praise God. When he stood in a boat in the sea. Glory to God. He stood, lifted his hands, and declared, peace. Be still. Come on. And everything around him quieted down. Yes. Glory to God. And if we have that kind of power, praise God, we ought to be able to do the same thing in our homes, right. on our jobs, yeah. even in our churches. Right. Praise God. We spend our time complaining. Praise God, this didn't work and they didn't move. Did you declare, praise God, the area around you? Amen. Ain't no devil zone. <laughs> Glory to God. Amen. I can't tell you where to be. You just can't be around me. <laughs> Glory. Glory. I know. Sounds funny. Because you don't trust the God that we serve. Glory to God. But when we trust Him, we can declare. Glory to God. The Hebrew boys were in the furnace. Praise God. The fire was burning seven times high. But the scriptures say it didn't even smoke them up. Glory to God. When they came out, the only thing that had been burned off was the bonds. Yes. Praise God. Their clothes were fine. Their mind was fine. Yes. Their bodies was fine. Yes. When we trust God, Hallelujah. praise God, our situation is fine. Yes. Praise God. And we've come to a place where, amen, we need to uh, uh, preach and Amen. Sweat and yeah. uh, fall apart to get you to say amen. Yeah. Praise God. And then after we've done that, you still are not sure that he's a way maker. Yeah. Glory to God that he's a burden bearer. Yeah. Yes, Glory to God that he's a deliverer. Yeah. Praise God. Well, Pastor, how do we show? You show when you believe. Yeah. And when you believe, you act. Yeah. Glory to God. I saw the brothers as they sang. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. And they thought they sounded pretty good. Yeah. How you know? Because every time they turned around, yeah. they turned around. Yeah. Oh, y'all ain't hearing me. Glory to God. Amen. We get in our, praise God, uh, places and we kind of get stuck and we might say words, but we don't apply actions to those words. Glory to God. But you need to decide, amen, you are going to fight or you're going to die. Praise God. Now, I don't know about nobody else, but I don't want to die. Come on and get somebody Hallelujah. by the hand and give them a smile and just tell them, fight, fight. or die. Or die. Glory to God. You said it because I asked you to. And as soon as I, you stop, you drop that hand. 
Praise God. But when there's confidence, praise God, you don't just fall apart. When there's confidence, the, the, the guy who wants to shake your hand and let you know that he's stronger than you, he holds your hand. Right. Glory to God. He squeezes your hand. Uh, he wants you to know, I've got some strength here, but all we're doing is shaking. All you're doing is shaking. Yeah. Praise God. But I'm showing up. I'm the strong one out here. Yeah. Oh, y'all ain't hearing me. And if we are going to serve this God that we serve, we ought to let the devil know we're the strong one. Yeah. Because he's doing everything he can to show us that he's the strong one. Glory to God. Amen. Uh, Goliath uh, decided, amen. Uh, praise God. I don't want uh, us to be fighting and you die. I believe that, praise God, we can settle this with champions. Praise God, I'm going to be a champion for the Philistines. And he said to Saul and the rest of his armies, he said, send me a man. Yeah. Glory to God. <laughs> Hallelujah. And we've gotten to a place where it's hard for us to find a man to sin. Yeah. Wish I could preach in here. Glory to God. But if we're going to be who God would have us to be, yeah. we ought to have in our midst a champion. Yes, sir. Praise God. That we can sin to fight our battles. Yeah. Yeah. Glory to God. <laughs> Hallelujah. And praise God, the God that I serve yes. has a man. Yes. Glory to God. And I celebrate yes. that man. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I trust that man. Yes. And I want to be like yes. that man. Yes. Glory to God. And I recognize I'm going to have to do a whole lot of work. Yeah. Praise God to be like him. Yeah. But I'm going to work at yeah. being like him. Yeah. Glory to God. I got to work on my mind. Yeah. Hallelujah, that says, praise God, I'm not giving up. Mm -hmm. Although I didn't see what I wanted to see. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm not giving up. Although I did not hear what I wanted to hear. Yeah. Praise God. I, I'm not giving up because the pieces did not fall into place like I thought they would. Praise God. In spite of what it looks like or feels like, I trust that man. Praise God. He's a champion. He has proved Himself. Glory to God. Never lost a battle. Glory to God. When I was in trouble and called on it, he heard my cry. Glory to God. He made a way. Praise God. Uh, Goliath said, send that man down. Glory to God. And all of Israel decided they weren't the one. Yeah. Uh, but there was one that wasn't in the army who decided Save. I'm not going to let the God Save. that I serve, yeah. praise God, be insulted, yeah. be defied. Yeah. Praise God. And if it costs my life, yeah. Yeah. praise God, I'm going to take up the fight. Yeah. Praise God. Uh, David did one thing before going to meet Goliath. Praise God. He stopped by the brook and he picked five smooth stones. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Praise God. I'm amazed. Praise God. Uh, that he would take the time to pick five 
smooth stones. Yeah. Okay, come on. Especially sir. if he believed that God was going to give him deliverance yeah. with the first. Yeah. Yeah. Praise God. But you know what I found out? Praise God. I found out that the giant had four brothers. Okay. Yeah. Praise on. God. Y'all ain't going to hear me. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. And it seems like, don't know for sure, but that David purposed, I'm killing you, and when your brothers come, I'm killing them. Praise God, because you defy the living God. And that's why he was talking the way he was talking. Who is this uncircumcised Philistine? How does he know who we serve? Does he know who brought us to this point? Does he know, glory to God, that he ought to be seeking peace and not war? Praise God, because though we look a little meek, we ain't weak. Oh, hallelujah. There's some strength inside of us. There's some power inside of us praise God and it's not enough to come to church tap your neighbor and say it's not enough praise God it's not enough to get all dressed up and praise God look like you came to worship tap your neighbor say it's not enough glory to God it's not enough that you know all the secret words Amen. That go along with the worship. Praise God. Because the enemy knows the same words that you know. Glory to God. What you need is a conviction. For God I live. For God I die. Praise God. I come over here to stay until I die. Praise God. See, you heard it so much that when you hear it, it doesn't move you. Glory to God, but you ought to be moved that you come over here to stay. You, 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 you ought to be, amen, so set in your spirit that when you hear it, you get excited. You remember where he brought you from. Praise God, the old folk used to say, praise God, my soul looks back and wonders. Hallelujah, how I made it over. In other words, praise God, I'm here. Praise God, but I, in my own mind, I didn't think I could be here. Praise God, but when I look back, I see he brought me hallelujah to where I am and, and I don't believe he brought me this far or y'all ain't gonna help me glory to God to drop me and leave me now praise God if he delivered me then praise God he's got some deliverance for me now Praise God, but I've got to get in the fight. And I've got to be willing when I'm in that fight. Praise God to fight to the death. I've got to stop the enemy from stealing my family. I've got to stop the enemy. Praise God from trying to wear me out on my job. I I've got to stop the enemy from thinking he can come in our assembly and act like the devil. Oh, glory be to God. I've got to let him know if nobody else is going to stand, I'm going to stand. Praise God and I'm going to fight with everything that's in me. Praise God that what's in me, praise God, is the Holy Ghost. And having the Holy Ghost, praise God, is so powerful. Amen. That it will change lifestyle. And it's not enough. Praise God. That we sit 
around knowing all of the style. Yeah. Praise God, what we need is power. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Because that enemy is going to work on your power. Uh -huh. Praise God to drive it out of you. Yeah. And you've got to be willing to hold on to it. In order to hold on to it, you have to have it. In order to have it, you must surrender. You've got to repent. You've got to clear your mind of all the mess that has been in there. Getting back at folk and talking about folk and deceiving folk. All that stuff is in your mind. But when you repent, that stuff starts coming out. But it's God because I want to be free. I want to be delivered. I no longer want to be bound. There's an army that's rising. Hallelujah. And we are not rising just for form of action. But we are rising in power. We are rising in anointing. We are rising with a focus. Glory to God. I've got a God that's going to deliver me. The rest that I want. The rest that I am. He's going to work on me. He's going to work in me. He's going to forgive my sin. He's going to wash my life. I'm going to get up with a praise on my lips. When I lift up my holy hands, I will bless the Lord. And I 
the sounds of the air. Oh, y'all ain't hearing me. He didn't even have a sword. He didn't even have a shield. All he had was a slingshot. And five smooth stones. But he came with the mindset. I'm going to fight. Or I'm going to die. Oh, y'all don't hear me. And I'm wondering. Yeah. 
Surrender your heart. Yeah. Yeah. Surrender your mind. Yeah. 